a Jamaica hot to everybody on this fucked up earth. You know why it's so fucked up on this earth? The Illuminati, the royal bloodline controls Jamaica, Mexico, Canada, United States, Argentina, all of South America, all of Central America, all of Africa, all of Europe. The only lacking North Korea and Iran. And once they get those two nations, you're fucked, man. We're all fucked. Bend your ass and kiss it goodbye. And it doesn't matter what color and how fucking stinky your ass is. Just go down there, stick, it, stick your nose in between your ass and just fucking kiss it goodbye, okay? Fuck me. Miles well enjoy life while you can, before you die. They just threw that over too, man. Wow. I was gonna show that big old cage on there and they just threw it over right as I filmed it. <laughs> Bummer. Okay, that's what's going on why I, why I decided to make another video it might it won't be my last one but it's gonna be almost in Jamaica be warned sign this is a be warned sign here be warned video should I say when you come to Jamaica and you're a white ass and you don't have no black ass on you you got your white ass People are going to steal from you. Each and every which way they're fucking going to do it, they're going to take your fucking money from you, okay? Even if you're a woman. I bet you even if you're a woman, it's probably even harder. Easier for them to fucking steal from you, though. So my last video, I walked down in Auto Bay and showing you all the bars where I got ripped off at. Well, some of them. I forgot one or two of them. But, uh, I go in the store, and a few days ago, I, I bought a friend's calling card. And it cost them $200 for a calling card. It cost $50. This dumb asshole didn't give me no change. And I said, where's my fucking change at, man? And he whips out $25. And I said, you owe me $25 more. This calling card is only for $50. $250. $50. No, I'm charging you $75. White boy. So I'm not going to go step back in that store no more. Of course, I can't step in any bars or, or some stores because they just rip you off. Charge you more money. Well, the black thieves aren't going to be able to steal from me too much longer. You know, I, I made my video yesterday and I said I was going to the to, to library to try to make a phone call. I couldn't make a phone call. So I had to find somebody. I had to call a phone. I gave them a shitload of money to borrow their phone. But I called up Blue Jet, my airline company, and says, you know what? When I came to Jamaica, I thought I had six months here. They won't allow me to live here for three months. Uh, the airline ticket company purchased a ticket for six months for me. Of course, their mistake, but I had to pay for it anyway. So I was able to afford my airline ticket out of Jamaica. So September 3rd, 2015, I'm out of here. Today is August 12th, 2015. 
So I got a shitload of days still to try to survive in life. But I'll tell you what. I'll be honest with you. This is a very fucking harsh nation to live on. Thanks to the Royal Bloodline, the Illuminati, the world central bankers having control of Jamaica, and keeping this one fucked up country, one nation, one island, a very poor island where everybody is stealing from each other. And when a white man steps on their soil, it's like a bunch of pirates coming after the captain of the ship. Everybody that's stolen from me up here is threatening my life, threatening to chop me up. Showing their guilt all over their face. Go in a bar and you give them a thousand dollars to do a hello hand quick trick and they flip out a hundred dollars and say you only gave me a hundred sir that's happened to me probably about six times since I've been here in two months to the point I don't even go to the bars I don't recommend you people going to the bars either it's just a bunch of con artists a bunch of thieves you're gonna get fucked you go inside of a bar okay Unless you're in a high-class resort, you know, where they keep the bums and the trash out. But I wouldn't be surprised they don't do that hundred-dollar trick to you, too, anywhere in Jamaica. Got a shitload of mosquitoes around here. Damn it, they're circling me like buzzards, man. So, it's been a very educational experience for me. You know, it seems like I lost all my friends. I lost a really good one, and I just tell him, hey, you want to talk to me, come talk to me, all right? Because I try to talk to you, and you don't want to talk to me, so just go on with your life. He just laughs. Reality, like they all do. Now, I don't know if my last video I told you I had some bitch coming up to me saying, Give me money or I'm going to call the cops on you. I had a twin sister do that to me yesterday and I just said, You know what? I'm off of Jamaica's island. I'm tired of being threatened. Can't enjoy life. Smoke a joint anywhere you want to. People threaten to call the cops on you. Well, that's an auto bay. Stay the fuck away from a bay. My battery's saying, yeah, I'm going to get dislocated from your brain cells, so. I am going to go try to apply for my business license still, okay? See what they say. I can become very rich here in Jamaica. My, my other video I showed you about uh, that land, building a home. If there's any investors, uh, give me a call, man. You got, think you want to get ripped off? Really, you just, I just seems like I can't trust nobody. So, uh, I just might as well go back to Mexico and drink with my rich friends and enjoy life a better way than here. You know, everything's expensive, too. Two hundred dollars for a pound of corn, two hundred dollars for a pound of potatoes. You know, chicken th three fifty, four hundred for chicken a pound. Goat four fifty, four hundred a goat. Uh, 
you know, some things are expensive, some things are cheap. I think the vegetables should be cheap, but they're very expensive. I think the ones that are selling the vegetables are the ones that are uh, growing it. Well, till next video. Remember, everybody love each other like the hippies do to have peace on earth because the justifiers, I don't see all of them loving each other. I see all of them lying and stealing from each other and begging from each other. Most of them I've seen so far. Till next video. Might be me just leaving Jamaica hell. I might just stop making my videos. But I won't. I'll, I'll come across something new every day in life.